I want to talk a bit about CI efficiency and CI cost. LinkedIn is saving 800 hours a day of CI resources because of build caching, and that number is growing. For Elastic, just the money they saved from the cache for their CI agents running on Google Cloud Platform was more than what they had to pay for Gradle Enterprise. This is not just about caching. Wherever we go, we see build actions and tests being executed unnecessarily, or often twice, build parallelization is not optimized, and build actions operate ineffectively. How could it be any different without the insights to monitor and profile, which is what Gradle Enterprise enables you to do, and which not just makes the build faster, but also reduces CI cost. We discussed in detail how to proactively manage and minimize avoidable build and test failures. We discussed how those failures affect developer productivity. Every build that fails because of environmental issues is also wasting CI resources, and Gradle Enterprise helps you to reduce this waste. This is also about quality of service. This chart from one of our customers shows you the percentage of CI builds per day that could not be executed right away but had to wait for a CI agent to become available. The timeline shows before and after the build cache was introduced and optimized. They went from 40 to 50% of the CI builds being initially in a wait queue to none. 